Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you my morning routine for refreshing and styling my wash and go. Many of you watched my review of the Eco Styler Black Castor and Flaxseed Oil Gel video, which I absolutely love this gel. Um, and you guys did too, but you had a lot of questions about how I maintain my wash and go over multiple days using this product. Many of you said you're only able to get like a day um, out of the product and you're wondering what my nighttime routine is and morning routine is for styling my wash and go. So I'm going to show you really quickly in this video. It's pretty simple, um, but I hope that these tips help you guys. If you have any questions, as always, leave them in the comment section below and let's get started. Okay, so, okay, so at night I use you know, a satin scarf. You guys have seen this nighttime routine before. I don't pineapple my hair any longer just because having fine hair that is low density, just pineappling the hair sometimes can cause my curls to stretch really far um, and it'll cause me to lose definition. So I have been using the scarf method for, I don't know, maybe close to a year now and it has worked really, really well for my wash and goes. So I tie my scarf into a triangle and then I pull my hair on top of my head and then I just wrap the sides. This is helpful because even though I sleep on a satin pillowcase, it just minimizes any friction on the hair and helps me to maintain my curls for a longer period of time. All right, so in the morning, I just take it down. And I should mention that before I go to bed, I do use my Mario Badescu spray on my hair and <laughs> not cute, but um, I, and then I also use it in the morning. So I use this spray. I have a larger bottle of it somewhere. I think it, it might be in my travel bag, but this is it. This is an amazing, amazing product and it is wonderful for your skin um, care routine. I use it in my skincare routine, but it's also really, really great for your hair as well. So I just take it and I mist my hair. The wonderful thing about this spray is that it has a really, really fine mist. So what it's gonna do is it's gonna infuse some moisture into your hair. Remember, a product will not give you moisture, only water will do that. Products will help you to retain moisture in your hair, but it's not going to add moisture to the hair. All right, so once I've done that, my hair is not, uh, okay, it's itchy. <laughs> Pardon me. But anyway, <laughs> my hair is not soaking wet. It's just nicely misted. This will probably dry like literally within about I don't know, two minutes total. It isn't very wet at all. If your hair is wet to the touch, then that means you're using uh, too much product, okay? So you just wanna modify that a little bit. All right, so after I release my hair from the scarf and I mist it with the water, I just go in and I begin to kind of reshape the hair. So I like to just shake it, this part back here, to kind of help the hair to fall down sort of naturally. And then I literally just go in with my fingers and I begin to style my hair. And using this method, uh, the scarf method, it causes my hair to like get bigger and bigger as the days go by. Like you guys have seen me on day one, one of my wash and go and my hair is really, really, my curls are really tight. My hair is much um, shorter and I don't have this much, you know, sort of hang time with my wash and goes. During doing the <laughs> scarf method really helps my hair to just stretch over a shorter period of time so the hair just gets bigger and bigger and more beautiful um, with each passing day. So I just literally go in with my fingers and I just finger style it the rest of the way. So this is what the curls look like currently. So they aren't quite as fresh as day one, but I don't think they look very bad. 
Okay, so to manage frizz or if I wanted to extend my wash and go a few extra days, I would go ahead and take my water bottle and I would literally spray the section where there was frizz. Like I'll just do this for example. Just spray that area or I would apply it to my fingers and then just kind of work it in and then I would literally just reactivate the product that's already in my hair. Now if it's like like this wash and go, if it's like day five or six or something like that, I would just go in my container and add a little bit more product to that section. Literally just a little bit here. Like, like you can't really even see that. And just go in like so. I told you it was easy that is it <laughs> so if you guys have any other questions about how I refresh my wash and goes using these particular products don't hesitate to let me know in the comment section below I hope this video was helpful and I will see you guys in the next one bye